Now, New York 4 Roswell police say someone stole a loaded gun out of a controversial former Braves pitcher's truck. Channel 2's Mike Pachenik is live in Roswell. Mike, John Rocker told you it's not the first time someone's broken into his truck. Well, Craig, the ex Braves pitcher told me he had just gone inside to get a workout here at this LA Fitness on Holcomb Bridge Road. He came out and later found out somebody had broken into his pickup truck, very similar to this one. They stole a loaded weapon and other items, and he says he is fed up. Years after he threw his final pitch as an Atlanta Brave, John Rocker still likes to stay in shape. So earlier this week, during a workout at this Holcomb Bridge Road LA Fitness, he says someone broke into his pickup truck. We spoke to Rocker by phone Friday. This is it's just, just a bunch of punk kids, you know, 18, 19, 20 year old punk kids. Rocker says he's not sure how the thieves broke into the truck, but he says they stole his wallet, debit cards, and most concerning of all, they, they, they stole a 357 uh, Magnum out of my door console that was fully loaded with 50 rounds of ammo next to it. Gone. Some punk 19 year old kid carrying a, a very, very powerful handgun right now. It's kind of deja vu all over again. That's because Rocker says this isn't the first time someone's broken into his car. It went almost, uh, almost 20 years, and uh, I've had my car broken into four times here. It's been L.A. Fitness every single time. We're always having um, a, a lot of problems in parking lots. Roswell Police Officer Lisa Holland says thieves have been hitting the city hard. She says prevention is the key. You know, take your wallet with you, your computers, guns. I mean, we're getting all sorts of items taken out of cars. It, it really is an epidemic. It really is. And Rocker is blaming management at the LA Fitness. He says they need to provide more security out here, some cameras perhaps, to prevent these kinds of crimes from happening. We did reach out to their corporate office for comment, but have not heard back. Bottom line, though, Roswell police say simply don't leave anything of value in your car. Live in Roswell, Mike Pachenik, Channel 2 Action News. Always good advice. We have more details on John Rocker. He was known as a hard-throwing lefty for the Braves and other teams, but his career was also defined by some controversial comments. In 1999, he sparked a firestorm with a Sports Illustrated interview. His comments were widely criticized as racist.